Okay, Lee Anderson. Thanks, Chair. Uh, just, uh, just a couple of quick questions, please, for, for Councillor Rebecca Knox. Um, I think you, you was in agreement that your force was institutionally racist. Is that is that correct? I agreed with the rec with the report, the okay. um, independent report, and so did the chief offer fire officer accept yeah. the findings. Okay, so of that can you report. please tell me, uh, Councillor, what unfair <coughs> advantages white people have in your force? I would hope not none. Not advantages. Did I hear you? Yeah, do they correctly? have any advantages? No. Then how can you be institutionally racist? Um, I, 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 sorry, I, I might have to get back to you. No, um, no, you no. don't. Um, You've said your force is institutionally racist, yet white people have no advantage. and. Yet white people have no advantage at all. Yes. So how can it be racist? Um, Maybe I was interpreting the phrase of it as a whole, as a, as a phrase that Nazir summed up. But I would absolutely stand by that the, the force was not racist. But going back to the, the way that no, no. it was described. Uh, I'm sorry. You, you, you said you agreed that your force was institutionally racist. So now I'm asking you. How is it racist? What advantages do white people have in your force? And, and I'm saying that there are no advantages. So then it can't be racist. Okay, I'm just, I'm just one more question, Chair. I'm just trying to um, nail this down. W what group of people in your force have an unfair advantage in their employment? I think what the, the, what the independent report in our previous report um, identified was that we needed more safe spaces for females and others to be able to call out where they were experiencing unfortunate and bad behaviour within the workplace. Um, we, we, do, we have put in some processes which will allow for that. We've got a, a, a safe to campaign, which means that um, individuals can find exactly the type of assistance and practical help they need in order to address the concerns that, of misconduct within the workplace. I get that, but I didn't ask Thank that. You. I didn't ask that. I asked which group of people have an unfair advantage within your force. And I was, I, I'm sorry, I was just trying to um, say to you that I think perhaps the, the females and others who haven't felt that they could call out and speak out in a safe space were, were disadvantaged, but now we're, we are addressing that. We're not complacent to the fact that that was a, a need which was identified in the independent report that was commissioned.